quick, just before the video starts, this channel has a daily giveaway of 1 million Shiba Inu tokens. All you have to do is be subscribed to this channel, like this video, and comment hashtag Shiba Inu. Good luck! There's some not so exciting news with Shiba Inu that might affect you if you're a sheep holder. So, it's important that you watch this entire video to find out what this new development is and how it affects you. But so that you don't run off scared, there's some good news as there always is with Shiba Inu. So, you have that to look forward to. Disclaimer Quick, just before we get into the video, have you checked out my NFT collection? It's a set of 10,000 unique and adorable Shiba pups just waiting for you to adopt them. You know what's even more amazing? You get to contribute to Sheep Burn as you get these pups. Right now, we burn 10.3 million Sheep tokens. And so that we can reach a dollar even faster, I've doubled the burn from 5% to 10%. So what are you waiting for? Let's make this happen. Each Sheba pup has its own unique identity and character from astronaut to cowboy. So don't miss out on your chance to own your very own Sheba pup and take Sheba Inu up to a dollar. I'll leave the relevant links in the description. Hey there, Sheep Army. Welcome back to another video on this channel. If this is your first time on the channel, allow me to specially welcome you. If you're looking for where to get daily Shiba Inu news and updates, you're in the right place. All you need to do is subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell so that you know when I post a new video. Now that everyone is good and settled in, let's get into the video proper. So, just yesterday, Ascend X, the crypto exchange platform formerly known as BitMEX, was hacked for $78 million. Ascendex tweeted that we have detected a number of ERC-20, BSC, and Polygon tokens transferred from our hot wallet. Cold wallet is not affected. Investigation underway. If any user's funds are affected by the incident, they will be covered completely by Ascendex. In documenting the issue, the block crypto mentioned that according to PeckShield, the assets were taken across three blockchains. The exchange lost $60 million on Ethereum, $9.2 million on Binance Smart Chain, and $8.5 million on Polygon, formerly Matic. Most of the crypto taken were stablecoins, including USDT and USDC. But Shiba Inu also happened to have been stolen. Now, even though the amount of Shiba stolen were not as many as the stablecoins, they were still substantial enough and actually belonged to people. What's worse is that this hack is coming just about a week after the BitMart hack that also happened to affect Shiba Inu holders. I talked about this hack in a previous video and how Shiba Inu committed to helping the platform to find out where the leaks happened and how to help them beef up security. Having a hack happen somewhere else just one week after can be quite devastating for investors. And because, as they say, bad things happen in twos, Shiba Inu has also dropped from its position as the top token among crypto whales. According to you today, the net worth of sheep holdings among whales has decreased and has reached second place. First place now goes to the other tokens category, which means that whales are not focusing on one token in particular and are redistributing their funds. Now, while a drop in holdings is not news that we'd want to be getting now or any time, really, it's not all actually bad news. First off, the fact that what's ahead of sheep is other tokens and not necessarily one token in particular means that sheep is still the singular most sought after crypto by whales. Secondly, the difference between the holdings of other tokens and Shiba Inu isn't that much. While other tokens account for 7.49% of whale holdings, Shiba Inu accounts for 7.24%. Even better is the fact that Shiba Inu is still a whole 2% ahead of the crypto directly behind it. So, I guess while there is bad news, we can be grateful for small mercies. Anyway, there's a significant possibility that these recent hacks have something to do with the drop in holdings. Some of the sheep tokens that were stolen could very well have been owned by whales. So, a theft would definitely cause a drop in the holdings. However, aside from the fact that Shiba Inu is not that far behind, there is something else to smile about. BitMart, the crypto exchange platform that was hacked before Ascendex, was promised to compensate users who were affected by the $150 million hack. The company promised that no user assets would be harmed and that they would pay out of pocket. According to a tweet by Sheldon Shaw, CEO of BitMart, BitMart will use their own funding to cover the incident and compensate affected users. They're also talking to multiple project teams to confirm the most recent solutions such as token swaps. No user assets will be harmed. The tweet was posted as far back as the 6th of December, so you have probably seen it before. However, I'm bringing it back as some sort of assurance. 
and also to say that there is a possibility that Ascend X would do the same thing. That is, pay out of pocket to compensate users who were affected by the hack. This would be great for two reasons. One, it would mean that those Shiba Inu holders who have lost their tokens would have them back. And two, Shiba Inu could actually get back its position as the most held token among crypto whales. Now, for those who might be scared or worried about these hacks, it's important that we all try to stay calm. I won't say that having these systems getting hacked isn't a big deal, it is. But it is also to be expected, considering that cryptocurrency is getting even more mainstream. Everybody now wants a piece of the action, and some are willing to get it by any means possible. While it is a terrible thing that these exchange platforms have been hacked, other exchange platforms must be learning from these ordeals and deciding to beef up the security of their platforms to prevent such a thing from happening to them. So I think it's safe to say that we can look forward to safer cryptocurrency transactions in the near future. Anyway, in spite of the negativity flying around, there's still a lot of good news. According to the Crypto Basic, 15 companies have already added support for Shiba Inu in December alone, and we're already barely midway through the month. More and more companies are adopting Shiba Inu as a method of payment or listing it on their platform as a means of payment, expanding its use cases. Some of these companies include Flexa, with over 40,000 US stores on its platform, BitPay, which is one of the world leaders in blockchain payment technology, Nerdy Frames, which happens to be a luxury sunglasses company based in New York, and Travala, which happens to be a pioneer when it comes to providing tourist activities for crypto enthusiasts. So, regardless of the bad news floating around, Shiba Inu is actually getting stronger and solidifying itself as a token to look out for. But going off on a quick tangent, you probably remember the Ripple CTO that mocked Shiba Inu, right? I covered that in a previous video, so you could go check it out. Anyway, Ripple recently made a proposal that doesn't seem very wise. But before we get into that, this channel has a daily giveaway of 100,000 Shib. For a chance to participate in the giveaway, all you have to do is subscribe to the channel, like this video, and leave a comment down below. Hashtag Shiba Inu. Good luck. So, Chris Larson, the co-founder of Ripple, proposed a method for Bitcoin to greatly reduce its energy consumption levels. He seems to be of the opinion that the only way for the transition to a low energy consensus can be achieved is through a change in the network's code. According to him, the least disruptive code proposal would simply take a snapshot of the current hash rate of existing miners and then reward miners on a pro rate of hash power basis through 2140. Existing miners would simply have the rights to future Bitcoin rewards without the need to expand additional investments in mining rigs. Larson seems to be quite convinced about his proposal and believes that it is fair because the system would reward miners for trying to secure the Bitcoin network over the years. And for miners who believe that a transition out of proof of work is a terrible idea for them, Larson believes that his strategy suggests that they can still get the rewards without spending a fortune on energy costs, according to Zy Crypto. However, there are a number of arguments against this proposal, chief of which is the fact that proof of work is what makes Bitcoin Bitcoin. Proof of work is one of the things that makes Bitcoin unique, and is definitely the one thing that makes Bitcoin as secure as it currently is. Another argument is that rewarding miners for a very long time after just a decade of work doesn't seem very wise. According to Zycrypto, mining hardware has a 5-year lifespan and some community members have stated that it is unwise to reward miners until 2140 for a decade of work. So, adding this proposal to that unwarranted mockery makes one wonder what exactly is going on in Ripple. Anyway, speaking of Bitcoin, there's only currently 10% left of it to be mined. Current info tells us that 90% of the total amount of Bitcoin has been mined. The coin hit its milestone just today. According to Cointelegraph, current data from Blockchain.com shows that Bitcoin in circulation hit 18.899 million as of Monday, meaning that only 10% of the total supply is left to mine. While the first 90% of Bitcoin took about 12 years to mine, the rest will take a little longer. This is good news for Bitcoin holders as scarcity causes a price hike. It also shows that creating scarcity, which Shiba Inu is doing with all the burns, is the best way to make a crypto more valuable. So, Bitcoin and Shiba Inu might be taking different approaches to this, but we can expect the result to be generally the same. And with that, we come to the end of this video. If you enjoyed the video, then please like the video and don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section. This really helps me with the YouTube algorithm. Also, please share this video with as many people as possible. Let's get the news out there.
If you're a true Shiba Inu fan, then you must check out this video.